I work for the New England Aquarium. North Atlantic right whales. Um, probably 400 to 450 of them left as far as our catalogue. While we're out here on the boat today, we'll try and get good shots of the left head and the right head of each individual because it's very distinctive. And so we use that as a way to ID them. And that's a way to track the whales as they move, as they migrate between the areas. And that's how we found out that it was the same population here that go down to the coast of Florida and Georgia um, in the winter. Another guy just to the left of us. Amy Knowlton, a research scientist with the New England Aquarium. Primarily surveying the Bay of Fundy for right whales and conducting, uh, carrying out photo identification of each individual that we see, and monitoring those individuals for um, scarring from entanglement or vessel strikes. My name is Jan Gilbo. I work for the New England Aquarium and the Canadian Well Institute. Several research uh, studies that are going on with small like, DNA. So we try to collect small sample of, uh, of skin to, and then we get, send them to those researchers. So we use a crossbow and a small tip. It's like the smallest tip of a, like a, a pencil. And we dart them and collect the sample, ship them to our collaborators. Then we wait for results. Um, 76 and 77. Yeah. 78 is a left head of O. It's going down. Everything's really clean.